Hey guys, I'm recording this video to show you a few modifications I've made since the last video. So first of all, here is my machine. I'm running two client on it. And here is the server or the DPS that's hosting everything, including the database, the Unreal Engine servers, and the server management system. So first of all, I've modified the database slightly to include default position X, default position Y, and default map. I'm gonna talk about them after a few moments. So here we have two players, each one on a different map. I'm gonna try to go to map two by here. Okay. Uh, I have added a new method to the uh, login that helps you to find the terrain height in order to spawn the player correctly. I'm gonna try to create a group. So now I'm going to try to go to the dungeon. On the VPS you will see that a new server is being launched and the new player is going to connect to it. Okay, here we go. So let's say for a certain reason the player is connected while it is on the dungeon. Okay, so now when it's going to log in again it will be spawned on the default location that I have mentioned at the start of the video. Okay, you can see that it spawned uh, outside the dungeon on the default location specified on the database. This location can be changed on one time by the player if it wants. So, and also I have fixed a small bug related to the portal when you are going to a dungeon. Now you can't enter any sort of dungeons when you are not in a group. So thank you for watching, stay tuned.